Uh, <clears throat> good to see you guys again. It's uh, another Monday. Difficult to stretch we've had. As uh, someone told me this morning, we've um, of course gotten beaten by the number one team, uh, number uh, six team, I believe, number uh, 24 team, and we got another top ten one coming in this week. Um, so it's been a, it's, it's been arguably the toughest stretch of, of games that I can uh, recall seeing. And, since 2006, I think we've played six national championship champions in, the, in that stretch, and it's uh, it's been a great challenge. It's been one that uh, we've learned quite a bit about ourselves, and uh, continue to be extremely proud of uh, the way our kids compete and, and prepare. It was great being back home in front of our uh, home crowd. That definitely is a boost for our kids, and that raises our level. And uh, we're going to need that uh, for the remainder of the year. So disappointed in the loss, of course, uh, when you have a chance to win a game that uh, you know the, the exhilaration that your young men would feel, uh, particularly from beating a quality opponent like A&M. You sure hate to let it, uh, let it slip away and not go your way. But uh, there's a lot of things that we've got to continue to try to improve. And making plays at critical times is a big part of that. Uh, give credit to A&M. Uh, they did that. So again, uh, Got a very tough opponent coming in this week, and uh, we're a beat-up football team right now, which I'm sure you'll you'll ask me about. But uh, we'll we'll get ready for it, and we're looking forward to the challenge. Coach, what, what were your thought process and your strategy on the last offensive series uh, yeah. when you got the ball back, had a chance to drive down? Um, well, we had a. Uh, we had a little uh, deal we've done the whole second half where we uh, tried to uh, short motion and see exactly what they're in, make the call accordingly. They were going to a boundary hammer with an eight-man front, which is very difficult to run against. Um, so we checked to a uh, pass, and unfortunately it didn't go to the, to the right place on that play. We had a guy in the, ch in the flat area wide open for a nice gainer. Get a, get a good drive starter. And uh, we made a bad decision, fall back with the, but to me that uh, was better than running it and being in second and 10 or nine or 11 possibly with uh, what I saw was coming. And they checked out of it, which took away the, uh, the two verticals, but uh, definitely had the flat open. 